How are you guys doing today? Um, yesterday you saw the video of what my grandson and I did um, for garage sales. And then we ended up picking up my wife and she came along with us after that. But you're going to see, I'm going to show you what the finds I got. And you'll be surprised what I did with 60 bucks. I mean, you're going to be very, very surprised of uh, what the profit is going to be on this. And I'll show you at the end, all right? Stay tuned to the end and you guys are going to see the, um, what do they call them there? The comps. Look, I'm going to see the comps at the end. All right, guys? I got to get ready for a birthday party today. So I'm going to show you these real fast and I got to get going. Okay, this is um, one of the sales. Um, if you remember, if you go back and saw the toy, the one that had all the toys, this is the bag, at, well, the tote that I was looking through the turtles. You're going to be really, really amazed about the turtles that I found. Um, I did go through them last night, so I brought them in the house. But these are guys that are missing like the legs or foot or anything like that. So I put them in a bag and I save those or even extra parts for <clears throat> for like this guy here. Um, I just need the little uh, thing here and an arm. So once, if I find those out, then that, that piece will be complete. But I mean, a whole bag of weapons alone here. So a lot of these in this bag have their weapons. Um, this here was a big surprise. I didn't actually even see this. Oh, he's hanging on there. Um, this is, uh, uh, I'm gonna, who is this? Um, Bebop motorcycle? Yeah, I think it's Bebop's uh, motorcycle. So, if anybody knows turtles, you know you know what I'm talking about. That's this guy right here. That's his motorcycle. So I got him, plus his bike. And then I got Rocksteady motorcycle. And <clears throat> the thing is with this one, this always misses the rockets. You know, there's a little button here you push, the rockets shoot out. I actually have, as you can see right there, I actually have the rockets. Both of them are in there. And then here he is. So that is also a complete set. And though you'll get to see the comps at the end for those. Those are pretty pretty amazing. The lady did tell me that some of these were old and discontinued. And when I was looking them up, yeah, they, they are. Um, here's another. These are all turtles except for one. These are, I mean, pretty pretty amazing finds. Some of these are discontinued. They don't even make them anymore. Um, this little guy here, this is you'll see this one in the comps. Um, I don't think I did a comp on that one. But this one, I think there's a comp on this one. This one's a rare find. Um, this one is actually the turtle that turns into a bike. So all you do is turn that and it does work. Um, here's another little rare find in there. I do have a couple different series of turtles in there. New and uh, old. I think a lot of these are from 2012 to 14. Here's a... This is from Ben 10. Um, anybody knows that? And this little piece right here is, oops, sorry, is going for uh, probably right around eight bucks in this condition, no weapons. Here's another. He's going for, you know, pretty decent money. And I didn't spend a lot on this. So I'm, I mean, an average on these is anywhere from $8. This is also a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. The, uh, people thought this was an alien. I was like, no, this is actually from the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. It's an alien from the series. So if I could find a couple of the other ones. This guy right here. This guy is called Slash. You look him up with his weapon. He is going for, I don't know, 12 to $24 used. So, I mean, I, I didn't spend much on this, on this whole thing. It was a whole tote. And I'm gonna show you another piece, even uh, Shredder here. Got all their weapons. I mean, there's you can go on and on and on in this bag. I mean, there there's a lot of them. This one's go, this guy right here is going for decent money too. Like I said, and there's another one with a with uh, his weapon. You're gonna go. I'm gonna show you all the comps at the end. Well, not all of them, most of them. But they're all. I mean, I'm just this. Probably four of these guys sell. I made my money back the entire day. So there, if you ever see turtles out there, even if you get the the original turtles, what they did, um, if anybody doesn't know, is this right here, their head is like um, soft plastic. You can actually push in it, you know, really soft. So you, it's almost, I don't know how you want to call it, but you can push on it. That Those are the original turtles. So if you find those, those are really big money. So it definitely got um, pretty decent. Oh, there's a guy. Pretty decent money on these. 
Yeah, there's, there's uh, I think, a set of the newer Turtles from the movie in there. And I think that Shredder is from uh, Turtles 2. So, when, usually when they're from the movies, there's more, more, uh, more value. I'm not going to sell the weapons individually. I'm going to match these up when I put them on uh, eBay Macari. I'll match them up. And uh, see Michelangelo's nunchucks there. Right there. So there's a couple sets of Michelangelo's in here. Definitely got... Oh, there, there's a little creature, which you're going to see, that actually goes to that. You're going to see he's he was going for, I think it's Weed Snake or whatever they call him. But he was going for a decent money, too. Okay, let me go out in the car, and I'm going to show you the rest of it. All right, so here goes. A lot of this stuff is from an estate sale as well. Um, found this at the estate sale. You guys remember that. Um, this is brand new. This thing is, doesn't look like it's even been used. I mean, the blade is still in the box. It's It's brand new. Uh, new paint sprayer. Um, this was at the turtle sale, so I got a whole bag of these old um, little Pokemons. This is also going to be decent money. This is all going to be profit once I, the um, turtles start getting listed. Those will pay for everything. Um, we got an antique uh, or vintage Santa Claus thing. I looked this up. This is from 82. The whole little Santa Village bench thing. Um, we got some. Uh, they get out of the sun there. Some really cool bows, bow ties. Of course, I couldn't resist with finding more, more, uh, uh, what do you call them? I'm drawing a blank again. <laughs> I did get these um, villages here, 56 or small ones, but I'll have to sell them without the boxes so I'm going to be able to get full price on them. These, these are little like wall hangers. I got a few of them. The, everything at the sale when I went was half off, so I, I couldn't resist just buying stuff. Um, this was there too. I gotta list this. Actually, I'll probably take it inside, list it now. Uh, this is a little desk lamp. Um, I thought this was pretty cool. Um, these comps aren't going, you know, as low as I thought they were. I figured maybe well, maybe five, six bucks. No, this is this is up in the teens, so it's definitely good, good profit on there. And of course, another you know, Pyrex, little what do they call them? A banana or bread uh, bowls, whatever they call them. I got this here. I thought this looked pretty cool. Um, I'm always risky about sending these out just because I just I got bubble wrap, so I'm just gonna have to wrap them real good. Um, little candle in there and it flickers. I got two of those. And this is the other thing I was talking about right over here. Oh, this came from the same sale, if you guys remember. Oh, there's this foot that actually comes apart, and there's a reason because this actually turns into the uh, turtle sewer layer. So this thing right here is going for a couple hundred bucks used without the accessories. And I think there's a couple accessories that I have inside in that bag that goes with this. So this was a really, really, really good find. I'm definitely making end the profit with the turtles in the house. And then this is putting me way over the top for the entire week um, from what I spent for between let me lay it down a little bit. Between what I spent at the garage sale and what I spent that day going with my grandson. We didn't buy a lot, we but we bought bigger items at a couple of sales. A lot of places didn't have it, which you saw. So we, I definitely made really, really good here. Um, this was a good weekend. So I got to get going. Got to get ready. I got to bring all that stuff inside here. <clears throat> I don't want to sit outside in the sun for too long, um, which I don't worry about my neighborhood I got my neighbors are always out and about so they they know who belongs here and who doesn't here so I got basically 24-hour security but anyways um thanks for joining don't forget hit give me a thumbs up hit that subscribe button catch y'all later and I gotta get ready for my birthday party see ya